All right, Michelle, your bestie's big night. What does it mean for you to see Rue leading a series on Netflix? It's spine tingling, spine tingling for me. For, to see it through, to kind of be around when Rue was writing it with Michael Patrick King, the concept, seeing it all come to fruition, the filming, the performing, the ideas um, on paper versus actually happening on Netflix. And it's just an amazing, for me, I feel like a mother. I'm so proud. Rue's mom's not here, my mom's not here. I'll be the mother. So I'm so excited. I got to binge all 10 episodes early, so I've seen the whole thing. I've not seen any. And there's no Michelle Visage cameo in this. I was like, when's she gonna pop up? When's she gonna pop up? What happened? Maybe season two. I think Rue needed to do Rue's thing. And I'm totally supporting that and totally loving that. You never know what comes next. Yes, well, I think that season two feels like Inevitable. Yeah. Good, I love that. Uh, we were sad to see the talk show did not get picked up. Are there any plans to kind of rework that, try it again? You know, it didn't get it didn't get picked up by Fox. That doesn't, you know what I mean? That's one network. Yeah. There's so many ways and so many places we can go with it and so much potential. So we're not giving up on it. It's just that incarnation at that moment, that's what they chose to do. But we still love doing it and we're not going to stop. Well, we got a lot of projects coming up anyway. Yes, yes. We're throwing another drag race on the burner, celebrity drag race. Why not? I mean, why not? It's a very British thing to do, um, have celebrities participate. Uh, and this felt like it was right, because this is the type of thing that celebs want to do. And it's amazing. Can you tease me a little bit of how it will be similar to the drag race we know, and how we're switching things up other than the celebrity aspect? I mean, you're going to have to wait and see. I know you're trying to get gossip. <laughs> Not going to happen because I love my job. But it's it's really good. Trust me. Ross did tell me we will be a little starstruck by some of the people. Not only that, there's some twists and turns coming at you that you're really not going to expect, and I think everybody will be really happy. All right. Uh, now, we love everything you do. We loved watching Drag Race UK. You do Ireland's Got Talent. You did Strictly Come Dancing. Would you ever go do The Masked Singer? Uh, if I could judge it, I don't want to sing on it. I feel like I've done that. Judging, call me. Singing, uh, no. It was Strictly like, you're like, I'm done competing on stuff now? Strictly was the only thing I wanted to do. Honestly, in all the competitions, that's the only show I ever wanted to do. And I did it. And I killed it. And I'm so proud of it. So I'm good with competing. Judging is the way for me. Would you ever do dancing in the U.S.? If Dancing with the Stars called you up, would you do it again? I had the best time of my life doing Strictly. You, you really can't, especially when you went far, because it's kind of not fair. But then again, Nicole Scherzinger did it, and she's a professional dancer. So it, I'll do it. Yes. It's a booking.